Welcome to Lavile Stadium in San Francisco. Uh, if it's fine by you, Grim, I'll probably just stand as we call this game. And what's the issue, partner? Uh, let's just say I got a little too much of the San Francisco nightlife last night. <laughs> I don't remember the majority of it. Thank God, I was raised Catholic. Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The New York Tyrants go up against the San Francisco 40 Nightmares. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. I'm a <laughs> Grim Blitzrow with you along with my partner, former player Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. And his life partner, the mini mutant head that lives on the shoulder of Bricks Jr. Hey, you just threw up on my shoulder. I don't often drink beer, but when I do, I get totally shit faced. I am the world's most intoxicated man. Say that again. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Eight. He's got his beast boost working. The player just trained fumble. You've got to protect the ball better than that. And that's how you run the football. First down. And it's first and ten. Hot. One, hot two, three. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second down and seven. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, three. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. Reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. Ooh. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And then Cats will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. It's a zap attack. Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in midair. It is a fumble indeed. Fumble Banji, the new game from Wilton Crabtree. He's at the 40. The 30. He's at the 20. The 10. And he breaks through for a touchdown. Listen to this crowd. Hey. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one time thing. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Hot, hot one, hot First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take. Huh. I didn't know that was a penalty. Yeah, these rule changes are ruining the game, Grim. <laughs> 
second down, and we've got a and they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. Second down in a mile. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Oh, look at this guy. And he's off to the races. Close, but no cigar. Third down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. It's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. A nice run for five yards. <laughs> Second down and five. down and long. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. And the easiest play in the league, and he chokes. Yeah, he's a choker. He's a midnight smoker. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Second down and five. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. And that'll bring up third and one. Oh, with a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. You can tell he's a berserker because he's frothing at the band. Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. First and ten. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. 
Touchdown! Hey man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. You take They want more points, so they're going for two. And he runs it in for an easy two points. The momentum in this game may be shifting. Well, those are just my balls. Hey, thanks for sharing, Bricks. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It, it means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And this game is up for grabs. Defense goes for the jugular. <laughs> oh, wow. If you're a defender, the only good QB is a dead one, Bricks. Ah, he must be pretty good then, because he is dead. And it's first and ten. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. First down and forever. And that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. Second down and seven. First down. First and ten. And he held on to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. point attempt it's good when you get knocked down you got to get right back up and fight uh, what about when you get knocked up what do you do then run First and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. That'll bring up third and one. And the defense spiked the offensive water with Strawberry Fields. And now they can taste... Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. 
and it's first and ten. That's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. First and ten. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Second and three. a decent punt and he just lets that one go he says no thank you and the defense downs it and it's first and ten his cleats are caked in blood and guts and he's looking to score that's a touchdown saving tackle right there First and ten. And that's some good old fashioned downhill running as he picks up nine yards on the play. Under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And that'll bring up second and one. The defender's one feet just kicked in. He's so fast, he can run the kickoff on touchdown. What and he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Ah, I don't think you can see that, Grim. And they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. Smart move there, stopping the clock with their first time out. And for all you know, maybe he's just stalling or wiring the ref some cash. And it's first and ten. Defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. A timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. And the offense goes into the hurry up formation to try to conserve time.
He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Ah, don't call things epic, Grim. Kids aren't gonna think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. First and ten. And the offense quickly calls their second time out. That's how you do it. Do what? Second down in a very lot. Not much there, maybe a yard. And that'll be their final timeout. Third down and ten. First down! He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, during the half, can you pick me up a soil and beer? The teams come out of halftime all tied up and ready to battle it out. Oh, geez, Graham, I hope someone ties them soon. They're going to play football. <laughs> Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all-you-can-eat buffets? They're not as literal as you think. And it's first and ten. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. And it's first and ten. The defense called a wolf to be dirty trick. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. At some point, they're going to need to put this ref out of his misery. Uh, how about now, for instance? Here's a hit. Dirty tricks attack the ref. <laughs> And this is a first and offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. First down in a mile. it for four yards second down and look out that's an all-out attack on the QB if he was still talking he'd be saying psycho killer Keska say what the fu 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 fuck
The offense is running low on quarterbacks. They have only two left. They might consider running the ball more. Second down and more than the QB would like. You ever get hit in the head with a boat all grim? Nope. Well, I have on several occasions. Not surprising. Multiple times on each occasion. Not surprising. And trust me, that hit was worse. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. It's not short, but this one shouldn't give the kicker any trouble. Unless he collapses under pressure and never makes another kick again. Hmm. And straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. And he picks up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. Man, oh man, he hit that line the way your wife hits the all-you-can-eat buffet of crab apple trees, Bricks. Ah, uh, you're telling me. She ate 47 Salisbury steaks one time. Thought she had food poisoning. Turns out her low intestines just exploded. Oh, that's a relief, because there's nothing worse than food poisoning. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. Second down, the size of Bricks Wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. And this guy is a stud, Bricks. Yeah, telling me. Nice run. No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Second down and ten. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Oh, what a brutal hit! Second down and six. out the quarterback just threw a murder ball quarterback passes for a touchdown if you don't kill this ref with the attack ref dirty trick you're gonna lose pal you kind of deserve it if you're this dead scrim <laughs> second down and they've had enough the offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had shown on today. Looks like it's a good fit. Just a great run for a touchdown. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> and 
You know, that should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. You gotta be kidding me! My sister could have made that kick! Isn't your sister in a wheelchair? I know, right? The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. And the QB might as well just bury himself now because boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. First and ten. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. Four. Touchdown! Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistake, man. You get up my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pad, Bricks. You're right. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. Second down and ten. The third quarter has ended, and we'll need a huge rally or a high death toll to make this one interesting. Third down, and the punter is warming up. They pick up a nice chunk of yards on that pass play. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense... And they fake the punt trying to catch the defense napping. See, sometimes passing the ball for one yard is useful. And it's first and ten. Second down in a mile. Talk about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Third down and the QB is saying his prayers. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. 
Rebecca. Oh, boy, they're going for it. This could get uglier than the baby resulting from an orcish family reunion. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Man, are these guys greedy or desperate? Either way, they're going for two. And the defense stops him cold. That play just got blown to hell. He got blown to shit. Speaking of blow, where's my little pile? When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. And he sinks into the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Second down and two. And this guy looks like Thor on a revenge bet. Oh, he was hitting mid-hurdle and fumbles the ball. And it's first and ten. The defense better look out. The offense called the beast boost dirty trick. Mistakes here, just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. And that'll be a first down. You know, Bricks, a lot of people have gotten pass happy in this league. Nice to see some old school mano a mano on the turf, huh? And it's first and ten. Should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. Second down and two. Third down and six. If you don't think you can make the interception, batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's gonna go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. And he put all of his foot into that one. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in the... Oh, with the punishing hit. And it's...
Giants, first and ten. A good run for five yards. Hey, didn't move the change of score, did it? How good can it be? Second down and five. And the defense spiked the offensive water with Strawberry Fields. And now they can taste sound, but Cameron... Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Third down and six. Two minutes left in the game, and we'll be right back after I uh, top off my drink. What did I do with that? Third down and six. got crushed the defense calls their first time out to save some clock I save clocks too Grim my wife hates them they take up the whole garage wait what you're married mm, it's complicated that's the way to keep the chains moving that was beautiful and that's two timeouts gone for the defense. But they've really got to get the ball back to their offense. But the offense has like 30 balls over there on the sideline just waiting for them. Why don't they just use them? Ask the ball boy. He didn't do nothing. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. The defense calls their last timeout. I don't know if they can pull off a win, Glenn. Why is that, Bricks? Eh, just a gut feeling. It also might be that porterhouse I ate for breakfast. How are you still alive? Tracks. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. He zings it in there for a four-yard gain. And that'll bring up third and one. Hot one, hot two. Hot. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. Francisco 40 Nightmares have won the game in front of their hometown fans. And the stadium is screaming like a kid's party at Chuck E. Cheesy. It was a decisive win. The home crowd is cheering and throwing up at the same time. Too much excitement and booze will do that to you. And the players are celebrating as they search for missing appendages. They left it all on the field today, or most of it anyway. Boy, you're not kidding. The blood and gun sucking Zamboni is coming out now. Hey, if anyone needs a liver transplant, there's a nice looking one down on the 40 yard line. And let's hear what the MVP has to say. Oh, I can't wait to hear what the most valuable prickhead has to say. Blah, 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 you suck. You take my fantasy game last week, you douchebag. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it.